Hello and welcome to this video. This time I decided to talk a little bit about my last self-defense experiment which you can find on my channel. But yeah, some people saying that it's really good ex exercise, some people say that this what I did is not realistic and the attacker was playful and yeah, this would not be like this in your situation. But how you can know how it would be in your situation? Not everyone are born with knife in his hands, so you don't know how the attacker attacking. In some videos, actually most videos, is that when you see the knife is already too late because you got stabbed in your belly or somewhere. So yeah, of course a lot of videos is that somebody just run and, and just move the knife like forward and backwards to stab in your belly, but yeah, not always is like this. And as you could see, I try to do these things what what you can see on uh, internet that somebody grabbed the wrist and tried to do some combo. But as you could see, Dylan wouldn't let me do anything. In this video, you can see that when the guy who present the technique, he grabbed their arm, the attacker are paralyzed, do nothing and waiting until this guy finishes combo and put him on the ground, and. Surprising Dylan didn't do that. He still fighting back. So when I grab his arm, he used his second arm or try to put me down Yeah, so uh, also we have to remember that now in our time a lot of people train different martial arts and um, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu or some boxing or something so Even you don't have to be expert, but you watch in TV So sometimes you know some techniques just because you're watching but yeah, I try to set my mind that this is a real situation and you know, I could go into the fight with him but if this is a real situation, I can try to go forward but what if my plan doesn't work? So when I come close to him, this is the same like I put myself on his plate if I can grab him, I can hit him, this means that he can also stab me or cut me So. It's a really bad deal, you know, one blue marks or two blue marks instead of my insideness going for outside, you know, because he cut my belly or something, you know, this is, and he have a, also like this 6 to 15 centimeters extra in his hand because blade of the knife, so I, I just thought that this is really bad exchange, like few blue marks ex yeah, instead of cuts or holes in my body, so yeah, here actually I try to do some police stuff, but as you can see Dylan already sweeped me and we fall to the ground and here he just put the knife on my belly and yeah, it's over. So remember, if you see somebody with knife, don't be around. Run away. Run away. Be safe. Thank you for watching. See you next time.